Hey everybody, Kataruki here with my November julep box. This is the classic with a twist box, and I'm very excited about what I got this month. The first thing in there is the holiday like gift guide, and it looks like they've got a whole bunch of different sets and things that you can buy that are, at least by my calculations, like 40 to 60% off the retail price, which is awesome. Like, look at those cute little lip glosses. They come in little ornament packages. <laughs> anyway. The first thing I got is the Lux Repair Skin Serum, and I wish they would have put this like in a vial or little tube of some sort because I ripped it open and it's like dripping down it. So hopefully it doesn't like dry up before I can actually use it a lot. It does seem very moisturizing and hydrating like it's supposed to be as um, repair serum. So kind of excited to try that. I've never tried a serum before. The next thing I got is the Glowing Lip Gloss, and it's kind of a corally pink with some shimmer in there, if you can see. No, I can't see it. Anyway, it's a good color. Um, it does smell nice as well. And I got two different nail colors. The first one is Cynthia, and it's kind of like a mocha, natural, taupey kind of color with glitter. And the glitter is actually more of like a gold and green tone. So that's really pretty. I think that's a good color for fall. The next thing I got, I'm pretty bummed out about. I I got a color very similar to this last month. This is Sheila. And it's kind of an orangey red. And last month I got Claudette. And... This is the one I got last month. It's almost the same color. <laughs> so that kind of sucks, but it is classic with a twist. Obviously red is classic, so I guess that's just going to happen. Uh, the nice thing about Julep is you can add things on. You can add up to three things, I think, every month. So I added on Aisha from the Boho Glam box, and this is kind of like a maroon wine color and it is glossy and I also got Lola from the It Girl which is a really dark blue and this is a satin finish so I, I put it on um, but I did put a clear gloss over the top of it to make it blend in with the other one which is glossy and the last thing I got is the Clean Slate polish removing pads um, this came with five packets in there and each packet has ten little squares with the remover on it and it does say these are good for glitter and gel polish too which the gel polish I think is becoming more popular as a like a do it at home kind of thing didn't really like these I thought they sounded like a really good idea and I I thought maybe they would like dry out really fast but they are very saturated in here and it just soaks like the color soaks right through it and my fingertips are still stained from taking it off because like you know it just soaks through the other side so kind of disappointed about that but I'm glad I got to try it and I can check that off the list so overall very excited with what I got and I will be doing another video I'll probably get my Etsy bag in a couple weeks and I will see you guys then I will link my julep and Etsy information below for you if you are interested and comment below with what you got in your box this month and let me know if you like it. Okay, bye!